How to cry on cue. This is a topic that actors will always ask me. How do I do this? What can I do? And there's a lot of different ways to get to the top of the mountain. There's not just one way to approach to make tears come out for yourself, if that's what you're trying to do. Not every actor has to do this. You don't have to always chase this in a scene, but maybe a director tells you, hey, you have to go and cry in this scene, and it's forced upon you. Whatever the reason may be, there are methods and approaches to doing this. Now, somebody on here was talking the other day about the yawn method and talking against it. I want to tell you that the yawn method is actually very usable and very approachable for a lot of actors to do if you practice it and how it actually is workable in a scene because sometimes people do get confused about this saying wait how can you actually use this method in a scene so the thing is if you've gone to drama school before or if you've been in a conservatory program you find out through your voice classes that you have this thing in your mouth in the back called the soft palate now when you yawn that soft palate gets raised and that's what can cause and initiate the tears to come and form in our eyes. Now, the thing is, when you yawn, you get used to raising that soft palate. Now, when you're in a scene and you can go and instinctively raise that soft palate, it can go and produce tears for yourself. Now, of course, if you're in the middle of a scene, you can't just go and start yawning right in the middle of it. That won't work. But if you're used to raising that soft palate from practicing the yawn, that's when it does become effective. That's when you can use it for yourself. Now, if you disagree with this, go ahead and talk about it with Bryce Dallas Howard because she has talked about this approach before a lot. You actually started crying and it was beautiful because you did it in real time. You give so much and you get so little in return. Oh, it's in a company that should be compensated. I don't know if you were channeling a memory or what you because I was I was talking about the Home Depot and you cried but I don't know if that's a technique it's that, technical it's technical. it's something that can be learned and taught everybody here could be crying you know when you yawn your soft palate lifts and you yes. Like, just do a yawn with me right now. Like, everyone yawn. Like and she's actually the one that kind of popularized this because after she talked about it, other people are bringing it up. But this is the true method and form of how you actually use the yawn, and it can be effective. And I wouldn't detract an actor away from using this method because if it works for you, and this process helps you, then use it. If you have a different method and approach for crying on cue, then use that other method. But I wouldn't completely just disregard the yawn because it is effective and it does work for a lot of actors.